hello friends welcome again to a new video we we'll start by drawing the upper part by selecting the line tool and drawing a line of 37 and 45 and 12 and from here we go down a distance of 40 okay and we copy this one from this point to this point that's okay and to start drawing the isocircle by using the axis end the outer one has it uh, has a diameter of twenty five so we draw from here a twenty five this is the radius not the diameter and the other one has a radius of fifteen We draw a line of ten, then six, then ten, and copy. Not copy, move them. from this point to this point now we draw another line and we go downwards a distance of 40 I draw another line from here sorry delete this one and draw another line from here to here and copy it from this point up to this point now trim and delete this one And now we draw another isocircle the first one has a radius of 10 and the second one 
has a radius. of 20. We can just make go down a distance of 80. and draw another line here now copy this one to the end point and to this end point also and here now we draw a line from the quadrant We draw this line and also this one. That's okay for the upper part. Now, at the, we make sure that this distance is 40 by writing the command dist it's also 40 it's it's already 40 we draw a line from this point up to this point and we draw a vertical line sorry not this point we draw a vertical line and no a line from the end of this point to this point and we draw a vertical line from here up to here and a horizontal line from here okay delete this one no need for it anymore and copy this one a distance of 5 to this direction and 5 to this direction and move this segment from here to here and also move this segment As we see here, we have a distance of 20, so we draw a line of 20 centimeters and move it from this point up to the midpoint here, and then we we copy it from here a distance of 12 and repeat the command again and copy it from here to here. Now we draw a line from here to here and also from here up to here 
can delete this one and trim this one that's it now from the end of this line we have a distance of 40 now so we draw a line of uh, 40 sorry line 40 and move it from the center up to center now we draw a vertical line of 20 so we draw a line of 20 and we draw a line of uh, sorry and we go to isocircle and another circle that has a radius of 12.5 12.5 now we copy this circle from this point up to this point according to the dimensions that we were given and we draw a line from the quadrant to the quadrant Now we copy this uh, circle again from this point up to this point and we need a line from here up to here Now we copy this line from this point to this point That's okay and we draw a line no we copy this one from the end point to the end point and we draw a vertical line here and trim now delete the segment and we draw a line from here as we see this width looks bigger than the width here that's because there is a mistake here in the dimensions and we have drawn according to the, the dimensions that we were given okay make sure by drawing the dimensions for example from here to here it's 40 that's okay that's that's correct and also this one from here to here it's 20 it's correct and this one is 10 and this distance should be 80 it's correct and that's the end of this video thanks for watching